Okay, so here's a little tip. If you are working your unique business or you're on my team or whoever's team you're on, it doesn't really matter to me, okay? But honestly, like, people are buying into you, so they have to believe you. You know what I mean? Like, like there are some things that I really like, but if you think about it, it's not really like what the thing is. It's like how it's presented to you and who the person is and how they treat you. And like people are buying into you, not just unique. Yes, it's great. Like, you know, my story is that I started unique and I really did it to take my power back because I was sexually abused as a child. So every time I sell makeup and every time I'm getting ready, I know that I'm changing a life like mine and my life. So I'm taking my power back, okay? But it's also my personality and the fact that I use the products because people see me use the products and eventually they're going to see a look that they like or they're going to, you know, ask about a product that they're needing because they're having a problem. And so branding yourself means, oh, that's the girl that does that. When they think of whatever it is that you're selling, they think of you, your personality and attitude and what they've seen it do for you. And then they start to ask questions. So Yes, you're going to message people and you're going to talk to people and you're going to try to get people to host parties, but you really need to be genuine and you really need to sell the stuff that you're selling. Like you can try to sell anything to anyone, but if you're not selling yourself and you're not making it believable that you love your product and that you love the thing that you're supporting, then people are never going to buy into it. So remember that people are buying into you, even if it's not unique, it's whatever you're selling, your own brand of whatever. People are buying into you. So give them something to buy into. Be genuine. Have a great day.